We're learning more about a deadly crash that killed two people. Investigators say it was caused by a woman high on drugs. The crash happened near Colorado Road and Sumner Avenue, just outside the city of San Joaquin. Sylvia Gonzalez is under arrest tonight. She's suspected of driving under the influence of drugs. CBS 47's Kirsten Mitchell spoke with an eyewitness to the, his, the hor horrific crash. Gonzalez is currently being treated here at CRMC for her injuries. As soon as she recovers, she's heading to jail. She faces charges for felony DUI and vehicular manslaughter. Cell phone video shows the deadly moment a car goes up in flames near San Joaquin. The lady couldn't come out from the brake truck. And then she went out and she was screaming like crazy. A man who saw it happen but didn't want to show his face says he jumped out and tried to save the two people inside the burning car. It just started, started popping everywhere, just crazy. And then uh, we tried to open the, the window and then the door and then it's too late already. He also recognized his friend's pickup truck flipped upside down. Inside was Yvonne Villapondo and her one-year-old child who made it out alive, unlike the two people who died in the Mercedes. CHP says the fiery crash began when the driver of this Honda, 42-year-old Sylvia Gonzalez, rear-ended the Mercedes. Mercedes then, due to that collision, uh, was forced into the opposing lane and was struck by another vehicle, which was a white uh, Chevy pickup truck behind us. Gonzalez was arrested for driving under the influence of cannabis and an illegal stimulant. The man who saw it all says he's lived in the area for 30 years and is familiar with the woman, and sadly, not surprised. I know her for a long time. She just has quite a history, let's put it this way. The bodies of the two people killed in the crash this afternoon were burned so badly that the coroner's office is still working to identify them. Reporting in Fresno, Kirsten Mitchell, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.